go. Let's check the wood stove for the temperature or the oven, excuse me. This is great. I am at between 360 and 370. I love that temperature. It's okay for it to be a little warm because it's gonna cool down a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and put my pie in and we're gonna put it on for 30 minutes and check it. All right, so let's go ahead and let it cook for about 30 minutes and we'll check it. And right now I have my vent open in the front to kind of keep the embers, the um, wood burning slowly. I've got my back um, vent closed. I've got my bottom vent closed. And of course, my oven vent is open. Okay, so there we go. I'm gonna leave it at that for about 30 minutes and we'll check it. All right, it's been 30 minutes. Let's go ahead and check the pumpkin pie. And we'll check the temperature at the same time. <laughs> Oh, it's looking good. Little bit more. Still a little goopy in the middle, which is fine. Let's see what temperature we're at. Is what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna boost the temperature up for the next 15 minutes. I've got it, the temperature between about 280 and 350. I'd like to get it all around a little bit better. So here we go. So I'm gonna open this up. And I'm gonna open this door this up a little bit and open this vent. And I'm gonna keep the back closed because I want this to warm up. And I'm gonna check my uh, wood too. Oh, that's looking great. That is great. So the wood is great, we just want it to keep warm. So I'm gonna put it for 15 more minutes. All right, let's go ahead and check our pumpkin pie. For the last time, the timer just went off on our 15 minutes. <laughs> oh, this looks like it's gonna be great. Oh yeah. And I'm gonna pull my foil off. That pie is looking beautiful. Let's go ahead and put it on the counter to cool. So now that I have my pumpkin pie out of my oven, I'm gonna go ahead and shut down my oven and just, hi honey. <laughs> Since we're all done using, our, using the oven, I'm gonna go ahead and shut down the stove and shut down all the vents and take a look at the pumpkin pie. And here is our pumpkin pie all complete. It looks beautiful. The crust, not too brown. Look at that. Oh my gosh, I love it. And I'd like to thank you for joining me today with Living a Sustainable Dream for cooking a pumpkin pie from scratch. Making your own pumpkin puree, making your own pumpkin pie filling from scratch, making your own pie crust, and then cooking it and baking it in the wood cook stove. How fun is that? I want to thank you again for joining me. Have a great day. I'll see you on the next video. Mm -hmm.